Question six. Mr. Watkins needs to buy some oil for his central heating. Mr. Watkins can put up to 1,500 litres of oil in his tank. There are already 850 litres of oil in the tank. Mr. Watkins is going to fill the tank with oil. The price of oil is 67.2 pence per litre. Mr. Watkins gets 5% off the deal of the, the price of the oil. How much does Mr. Watkins pay for the oil he needs to buy? So we need to work out how much oil he needs to buy, what it will cost, and then what the value is after he takes off the 5% saving. To work out the amount of oil he needs, we could look at how much space is left in his tank, because it says he wants to fill it completely. So if he can have 1500 litres initially, but he already has 850, you can take one number away from the next, so 1500 subtract 850 to leave him with 650 50 litres of space. So if he wants to fill his tank, he needs to buy 650 litres. Now there are two ways that I can think of to approach this next problem. We could take off 5% from the cost per litre, or work out the total cost and then take off the 5%. I'm going to choose the second method because I think it's easier to work with bigger numbers when dealing with percentages. So, if we look at the cost of the oil initially, we have 650 litres. Each litre costs 67.2 pence, so that's a multiplication problem. We're going to times 67.2 by 650. Multiply by 67.2, which gives us 436. Eight, zero. Now that's in pence at the moment. Because it's such a big number, it's easier for us to deal with in pounds. So if we divide this by 100, we will get 436 pounds and 80 pence. Now it says that Mr. Watkins gets 5% off the price of the oil. And again, there are two ways that you could work this out. You could work out what 95% of that number is, or you could work out what 5% is and take it off. Again, I'm going to go with the calculating 5%, because that way we can do this step by step and potentially even solve this without a calculator. So, to find 10%, we can divide 4. 136.8 by 10. So if I divide that by 10, we get 43.68. 5% would be half of that. So if we divide by 2, we get 21 pounds and 84 pence. And that's the saving that he will make on the price of his oil. So the final cost can be found just by taking that saving away. So that would be 436.80. Take away 21.84, which gives a final value of 436. take away 21.84 which is 414 pounds 96 pence